Yo, it's your boy Flux. What is going on today? I have for you a new video called I have one for him and one for work. And if you don't know what she's talking about, she's talking about her. <coughs> she's yeah, this this woman has has two working lady parts. Let's to to put it as I don't know, as politely as possible, I guess. Yeah, so this is love don't judge. Let's get right into it. Two uteruses. One is for my husband and one is for work. Quite fascinating though. Like how this has occurred. Because you know, obviously the whole, it, it's kind of like a, a one is it's a whole mutation kind of thing. Uh, where, yeah, so she is two. You see, would it be uteri instead of uteruses? Two uteruses. One is for my husband and one is for work. So once That's for her husband, once for work. For only fans. The yep, reaction. okay. Only fans. Fair enough. You know, she's making money. Realistically, you know, from what I've seen with this house already, it's it's bougie. She probably makes a lot of money. She's probably quite a big creator. Fair enough. Personally, not for me. I wouldn't date someone who has OnlyFans, but that's, that's, that's my preference. Uh, I'm, and I'm sure a lot of people don't really want to see me doing the deed with a girl on OnlyFans. I don't want to see me doing a deed with a girl. <laughs> Just, I don't want to see that. I wouldn't pay to watch myself shagging. I'm good, thanks. That, that, I'd burn my eyes out. I have to put bleach in them after I see that. Say some really nasty comments judging me as a mother, putting me down, calling me a sl I wonder what it's like to have your husband not interested in you anymore. I just feel sorry for your kids. I quit my job as an electrician after 12 years to join Evelyn on her OnlyFans. My family yeah, so they, judged her. They make, they make bank. Purely because they don't want me to come on. Just looking. Sorry, I'm just looking at the house, the house behind. These guys make bank, bro. These guys make bank. So yeah, fair enough. Quitting a job as an electrician. Get out, just making probably like 10 times, 20 times more. Yeah, so these guys, ah, oh, they're I'm Aussie, Evelyn, okay. And this is Tom, and we're OnlyFans creators. So we first met when we were around 16. Evelyn was dating my best friend at the time. Oh. A few years goes by <laughs> and we had no contact whatsoever, and then around... Can I just say as well, not that this only appeals to me, because I'm an old man trapped in a young man's body, right? <laughs> this is cool. These mugs are cool. I like these mugs. Um... God, this house is huge. What the fuck? This is I, a bit tacky. I'm not a fan of gold. Um, but these are cool. I found out that I had two uteruses or two completely independent reproductive systems when I was 20. Though I always knew something was wrong with me. How do you not quite a young age. figure that out earlier the though, to is be called fair? Complete uterus didelphies, and it means that I have two completely independent reproductive systems, two vaginas, two cervix, two uterus, and one ovary on each set. So, two vaginas. I don't even, wow. Are those buttons on the mirror? Anyway, that's not important. Sorry, the, the rich people. It's how how the rich people live. That's it's, it's mad. But no, what was I gonna say? Does that mean she can get pregnant twice? Like she can have a child in each, like from each ovary or each uh, set of the reproductive organ? That'd be cool. I mean, not for her. That would be painful as fuck. But. Could have, she could have twins at almost the same time or like oh actually what if she okay i have no clue how this works so i might just be talking right out my ass what if she gets pregnant uh she gets pregnant right she has she carries it for four months then she gets pregnant again in the other one then she has one baby and then like f four or five months later she has another one so it'd be like kind of twins that in the womb but they they're born at completely different times is that possible impact of my dating life because it's always a bit of an experimentation to try and figure out what feels good my right vagina is my favorite so I okay so yeah there's there's i guess there's favorites as well one has a better feeling than the other that's it's, you know it's cool maybe different nerve endings and stuff you know i guess i guess they wouldn't be exactly identical either like, um, because obviously each one, I, I assume each one's different. I'll, I'll let you know when I finally see one. Um, 
but yeah, I assume each one is different, uh, slightly, you know, slight, slight differences, uh, and then each one is a, a different feeling, I guess. For Tom, for my husband's and my left vagina, I don't really like that one as much, so I use that for filming. With <laughs> I first told Tom about my condition before we. So are they were swingers? I like to warn guys, uh, sort of, so they're prepared um, before we do it. <laughs> He reacted a little shocked, as do most people. I don't think he really believed me, to be honest, until I showed him. And then, yeah. That's what that's what she thinks. He actually, he, he believed her the whole time. He just wanted to get a look. He just wanted to be like, yeah. All right, bet. Show me your <laughs> Oh, that's foul. That is actually disgusting. Oh, I'm sorry. I decided to start posting about my condition online to raise awareness about different bodies. I All right, so uh, obviously the last this is from Truly this video. The last Truly video we watched uh, was the breastfeeding. I feel like okay, this is slightly different. They're they're posting about it, making aware like people aware of the condition, which is cool. It's always useful. It's a, it's actually quite a good use of TikTok. Doctors told me that it would be unlikely for me to have children because it's very hard to tell which side is off. Okay, so from what we were thinking earlier, I guess it's not impossible. Obviously not. She's got a child. Getting on which side is not. Okay. Um, but thankfully, it didn't take us very long. We conceived naturally during. Oh, I see. So you can't tell which side is ovulating. Does that? Okay, I'm thinking too deep into this, right? Would that mean that she has two different, like, menstrual cycles? It's a cool way to get around town. Uh. Oh, why we were filming for OnlyFans. Very lucky. Uh, we now have two children. Oh, she got pregnant while filming for OnlyFans. All right. Bro, um, <laughs> bro, imagine. I don't know about Australia, but in the UK, so you would get violated for that. would be like, yeah, I, I found your conception video on your mom's OnlyFans, you bitch. You'd just get absolutely violated for that. That's actually quite funny. That's quite funny. Okay. That's the, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tom's sister Emma is coming over today to discuss how she really felt about our relationship. She really didn't like me at first. Hello. She was initially very reserved about meeting Evelyn, especially knowing what her background was and, and how we were getting into online work together. When I found out she was an OnlyFans model, I was quite shocked. Tom also took a while to tell me and we don't really have secrets between each other. So the I mean nowadays it's it's not really that shocking it, it it's not it's not that shocking to be honest there's probably i don't know you probably walk past a bunch of only fans creators every day it's it's they i don't know i don't know what he, she expected an only fans creator to look like because you know they're just normal people to be honest had some pretty negative feelings towards it and didn't like it too much. How did Still looking at her tattoos though. Yeah, I definitely found your dad in particular. He had this preconceived notion that uh, I was the one sleeping around and that Tom had to deal with it. And it's really funny because it's complete opposite. It's actually him getting to sleep with all of my girlfriends. So I found that really unfair. Yeah. Okay, so I mean, I don't want to delve too deep in because frank quite frankly, I could not care less uh for how they do it but they're both i mean i i guess i'm not entirely sure i don't know her content um but i guess they both sleep with different people as well which uh also not for me personally i'm quite happy with one um you know that's just me Everyone's different. Everyone has their own opinion, but yeah, no, nah, I'm good. Recently, and he's she going looks like Lana Road, yeah, Lana yeah, Rhodes, actually. So, how did you really feel when you first met Evelyn? I was pretty skeptical with her line of work, but now that I've come to know her, I didn't realize it would have such a positive effect on your relationship. So, will you tell the children what you do when they grow up? That's a good question. Uh, I think question. we're going to wait until the time's right. Definitely going to be honest with them, but there's a the time for that. And yeah. I think that when they start asking questions, when they get a bit older, it's going to be a really positive thing to be really open with them. But okay, I, I appreciate that. That is good. Uh, but I feel like 
they are going to find out years before you tell them. That everyone knows or will find out everything is you know it's the same when I grew up. Yeah, it's you know so it's it's good to be open with them. Um, but they probably will find out either on their own by accident or through a classmate. It seems. What I'm trying to say is, um, you know, we don't know. A lot of OnlyFans creators who have had kids aren't, they aren't that old yet. So I guess we have to see in the future, uh, you know, what happens if anything happens. What if, you know, if they get bullied or anything like that. Who knows? Who knows? Because obviously it's, 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 it's something. Kids are, kids are ruthless. They'll pick on anything. Um, they're, they're unhinged. So yeah, there's, it's, it's always gonna, it's, it's kind of inevitability. Um, in the 21st century, to be honest. Definitely at the right time. So what made you change your mind about Evelyn? Once I got to know her and see what a beautiful person she is. It's almost like she's a normal woman. It's crazy. I'm so glad that she's in my life. I would say to people that judge our relationship to mind their own business. And just because we live a little bit differently to other people doesn't I'm mean not a fan of the glass door, door though. I what if you're trying to avoid the mailman or something? So caring and compassionate and kind towards everybody that she comes across. I love that Tom makes the best dad jokes. He keeps me laughing every day and he's just the best. I appreciate I am a fan of I'm dad not sure jokes. What the future holds for both of us, but we are moving into a bit of a different area. We really love renovating, so we've bought some more houses and we're going to just really focus our energy on that. Fair play to them. They're making bank online and then putting it into houses, flipping them. Fair enough. Power to them. Um, but yeah, this is... Internet's crazy. Let's spin your boy Flux. Like and subscribe to the channel. Have a watch of the various backlog of videos I have recorded and uploaded. All that cool stuff. There's plenty of them. There's an Angela video. If this one comes out before the breastfeeding video, there's a my hus I breastfeed my husband video. Hopefully, this will probably come out at this point. But yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling because otherwise I will not stop talking. It's been your boy Flux. Peace.